Mateus, seven years old, was our first participant. He had suffered from migraines two to three days a week for years. But after one hour of our procedure, he stopped having migraines for six months. This is the power of placebos. My name's Jay Olson, and I study how to maximize placebo effects. Usually when we think of placebos, we think of a sugar pill that has no active ingredient but can still have profound effects. But placebos can be any kind of inactive treatment, like an injection with no active ingredient, or even a machine that does nothing, but you still believe that it can help you. Now, placebos are the most studied procedure worldwide because they're often used as the control group, but they're one of the least well understood. We do know some factors that make placebos stronger. So complicated or expensive looking procedures work better than simpler ones. So machines work better than injections, which work better than sugar pills. Children experience more effects than adults do. In my research, I combined all these different factors in order to use placebos not as a control, but as a treatment. Right now, we're focusing on two disorders, migraines, so headaches, and ADHD, attention deficit hyperactivity disorder, characterized by fidgeting and reduced self-control. Now, these disorders don't have ideal treatments. Often, they require expensive drugs that can have big side effects, even changing your personality. So we take children with these disorders, and we introduce them to a placebo machine. It's actually a broken brain scanner that looks and acts like a real one. Now, we tell children, although this machine is completely inactive, it can help your brain heal itself through the power of placebos. In fact, placebos work even if you know that they're placebos. So we put children inside the scanner for about 15 minutes, and we give them positive suggestions that this procedure will help reduce their symptoms and improve their strengths. A month later, we follow up with the families. 90% of them report improvements in their kids, from reduced fidgeting to better sleep. And in some cases, children report massive, lasting improvements. Like Mateus, who a year and a half after his initial session is still only having 10% of the migraines he used to. Now these results are still at their early stages, but we're hoping to develop new placebo-based treatments that are safe, effective, and have no side effects. In doing so, we can harness the power of placebos, and more generally, the power of the mind. Thank you. <laughs>